Today's video is going to talk about how to get a really nice tight end for really cheap. Uh, we're talking budget series, we're talking mutt, uh, something that I'm kind of new to and, I, and I've been trying to get better at for you guys. And I got a guy today that in my opinion will get the job done at an elite level and he doesn't cost a lot of coins. We're going to talk about a tight end today. Tight ends in this game all have kind of the same um, need but one of the things we talk about when we talk tight ends one of the most important statistics for me uh, is catching traffic and spectacular catch I want a big body tight end kinda like a Rob Gronkowski that can really make some plays and uh, what we want to show you here today is this Kaufman guy and we actually got Kaufman for about what this one says about 900 coins you see here he's normally about a thousand coins and somewhere in there but let's take a look at Chase Kaufman Look at this man. First of all, let's note that he is six foot six. I think that's an important thing to distinguish right off the bat. Second of all, this man has a 93 spectacular catch with 88 catch in traffic, and this man is only a thousand coins. I want to compare him now. Keep these stats in mind. I want to compare him with a more elite tight end, you know, an 89 overall or an 82 or whatever, you know, whatever you may be, whatever's in that field. So we'll get Kaufman's name out of the search category, and uh, we'll show you uh, specifically some tight ends. Uh, and what I find is that he's actually higher rated than most tight ends. When we talk about the ratings that really matter, when catching traffic and speed and spectacular catch and those things, those, those are the ratings that really are uh, important. And let's just take a look at this. We're just going to go from the top tier tight ends down. Uh, this is Gronk, and we know he's going to be better in most categories. He means he's a 91 overall. He's going for 300,000 coins. But also notice his spectacular catch, 93. Kaufman's spectacular catch, 93. Kaufman's speed, 81. Gronk's speed, 82. Hello. Comparable. Not as good. But he's 302,000 coins cheaper than Rob Gronkowski. Uh, his catch, Gronk, Gronk's got eight higher catch in traffic, so we do understand that that is why he kind of gets the edge. Now, let's take a look at Witten. Jason Witten, 79 spectacular catch, and Kaufman had 93. Um, yeah, he's 14 points higher than Witten is in catch and traffic. And then, or, or excuse me, in spectacular catch. And then in catch and traffic, Witten kind of has the edge by about four points. But also, Kaufman has the edge in speed with five points higher speed. So... And again, 31,000 coins cheaper. Uh, you know, just something to think about. Uh, Antonio Gates, we'll take a look at this man. 79 speed, once again, Kaufman, 81. Catching traffic is only 80. Kaufman's catching traffic is 88. Spectacular catching, Antonio Gates is 90. Kaufman is 93. Those are three statistics that are really important when you talk about tight end play. Antonio Gates is going for, uh, well, it's kind of a bad example. Let's just say about 6,000 coins. And for a thousand coins, you can purchase Chase Kaufman. Uh, you do the math. In my opinion, Chase Kaufman's a much more likely, um, a much more likely uh, guy that you want to look into getting. Uh, real quick, I want to take a look at some of the top, more more top tier tight ends if I can find them. Watch these guys are kind of interesting the way they've got them rated. Like I said, Gronk's going to be the main one, and he is a little better, but he's not. You know, he's not so much better that that you're like, gosh, I got out of Gronk. I gotta spend all that coin on Gronk, um, and and for the most part, guys, tight ends this year are really kind of serviceable uh, as far as affordability goes. But uh, let's take a look at Austin Safari and Jenkins. Now, this is a guy that I really like. Um, but what you're gonna notice is that he's only got 88 spectacular catching, and you know that Kaufman has 93, and then his catching traffic's 85, and Kaufman's is 88. So I mean, and he's also an inch taller. Now Jenkins is a little faster. He's eight points higher in speed. But, you know, you kind of, you know, it is what it is. Um, but again, I really do. I really believe that this Kaufman card uh, is really pretty serviceable uh, to this. And let's just let's just kind of niche this here. Let's niche it to like 85 to 89, these tight ends. Uh, and what you're going to see is like this Olsen card. This guy's going for like 30,000 coins. Um, and notice his catch and traffic is one lower than Kaufman's. His spectacular catching is actually five lower than Kaufman's. Um, his speed is only two higher, and Kaufman's an inch taller. I mean, this is a big deal to me. Um, so there's that, and then Julius Thomas card. And I haven't even looked at these guys. I just know this off the top of my head. Um, Thomas has the same catch in traffic. 
a little bit higher speed but lower spectacular catch. I mean, I mean Kaufman is serviceable, well, especially when you consider the fact he's 17,000 coins cheaper than Julius Thomas, and he's you know 49 or however many thousand coins cheaper than Antonio Gates, and and um, you know all of these guys. I mean, Kaufman is an option, in my opinion, that I do not. Um, you know, I personally really believe he is uh, a phenomenal. He's my tight end. I mean, he is a phenomenal option. He never drops the ball for me. He's reliable, um, and I would just, I would just highly, highly, highly recommend um, you guys checking this card out. Like I said, you know, you can normally get this card um, as you see here, going for about 950 coins, um, and that's about more what we're gonna see. And uh, just something to think, think about, something to look into. Uh, but this is one of my favorite budget cards uh, in Madden NFL 16. So, anyways, guys, uh, that's what I got for you guys this week. Our Mutt budget item, Chase Coffin Football Outsiders. Really enjoy this card. And I think it could help you have a better offense in Madden NFL 16. Thanks for watching, guys. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to take the time to go over and look at my YouTube channel and see if you would like to subscribe. If you subscribe, what it's going to get you is it's going to tell you when I post new videos, and you're going to be notified. That way you can stay up to date in all of our tips and tricks.